first day shooting with this new Canon camera. Supercar Sunday. How do I look so far? Look okay? About the same? These look pretty cool. today. Ken is over at his 57 talking to a bunch of people. Another cool one. Good morning. What's up? <laughs> Supercar Sunday. today. Mm -hmm. Kind of light on cars, not too bad, but light as far as people's attention span. Everyone seems a little sleepy. It's Sunday morning. Oh yeah, that's right. <laughs> Hello. Good morning. He's, he's good morning. Good morning. He might jump, but he's good. Oh, there it is. <laughs> Stop back at the 
uh, at the pad, had some lunch, oh and now we're back in the 57, and we're going to attempt to go to the Exiles show, but we are slightly running low on time. we got to go pick up Paul Grisanti. Paul, we're coming to get you, buddy. We'll see how it goes. Ken's driving. You never know. Now we have Paul uh, in tow behind us in his Mercedes, right back there somewhere. I think he's being chased by a bunch of motorcycle guys heading to the Exile show. We're not going to have a lot of time to hang out at the show, but we'll go check it out and show you guys. This was where um, Dr. Quinn Medicine Woman was filmed, as well as many other Western type of movies. But now there happens to be a motorcycle show, so that's what we're doing. We're at the Exile show. He has brought in uh, his amazing car, but you also have a bike this time. I got a bike. That's really how I got started. It was with the bikes, and then the car evolved after that. So the, the bikes are a little less work? Uh, not in my case. No. <laughs> it started on a TV show, and it was a crazy amount of pressure, and uh, yeah. the bikes were definitely born out of a labor of love. On, on average, how long did it take you to do a bike? I, every part is handmade, so... Long time. Yeah, I mean, if I had to squeeze it all and condense it all, yeah. it'd probably be like a year, maybe, yeah. to film yeah. before I felt but they, good But they it. want it in about a month. That ain't happening. Yeah, right. All right, well, let's go check this out. <laughs> Of exiles, it was pretty good. Don't step in the horse poop. 
Not good. It's hotter than hell. We need to go back to the beach. It's about 2.30. We kind of run out of time to be able to do all the things that I had planned to do today. Just not enough hours in the day, plus LA traffic and all that stuff just to get to these places. We'll have to check out that massive house on a different episode, on a different vlog. I think it's gonna be around for a while, considering they gotta find someone who wants eight and a half bathrooms. Kathy's gonna join me. We're gonna to head to the beach, jump in the water a little bit, and then wrap up the day. Are you happy we're going to the beach instead? Yes. Always. I'm just gonna say it. I'm just gonna throw it out there. I'm just gonna say it. I, I bit off too much, more than I could chew. I literally went too far. And that is that I had, I had a, a slew of things that I wanted to do today. A couple of car shows, and then going and checking out a couple of houses. Didn't quite make it to the houses. Well, technically I made it to one house, but I didn't vlog it because it's a house we've already been to. I've already shown you guys. Didn't want to show you the same thing again. We just kind of went and looked at it. You know, we're looking at houses. That's all I can say. We're not necessarily looking for an eight $0.5 million dollar house, but we're looking at houses. It's a combination of basically wanting to move into a, a place on the beach and at the same time just liking to look at houses and, and, and I'm vlogging that, showing you guys that because it's just freaking cool. You want to see what it looks like looking through these? Check this out. Huh? Huh? Is that cool or what? Oh, it's like, like sci-fi movie. All right, had a good time with Ken going to the car show, uh, to Supercar Sunday. But the Exile show, that was pretty cool too. I never really done that. Went out to a, a, a show that, you know, normally you go to car shows and everybody's got all of their cars clean and polished and everything's nice. And then this show was like in the dirt. So everything was like filthy, you know? And it was just like, between trying to clean something, wipe something down, uh, one bike goes by and this <laughs> covers everything with dirt again. But despite the, the, the heat and the dirt and all that kind of stuff, pretty fun show. Russ, Russell's the guy that put together the show. Nice job, man. All right, tomorrow's Monday. Big, big week ahead. I don't know. Maybe, maybe not really sure. It doesn't really matter. I love Mondays because it's the beginning of a whole new week, a whole new epic amount of cool things that could potentially happen at any given moment, and I'm raring to go. No matter what it takes, I'm raring to have an awesome week. You should be too. Set your intention. Say, I'm going to have an awesome week, and guess what? That's what happens. Make it happen, people.